Aloe vera gel contains antioxidants, enzymes, vitamins A and C. It helps to exfoliate the skin, though mildly, but it is also in the treatment of bones, skin blemishes, especially acne, which is why we are making use of it today in this tutorial. It is my go-to eye cream because of its ability to remove dark circles. Because of its high inflammatory nature. Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'll be teaching on tutorials that has to do with um, natural skin care tips, hacks, and lifestyle as well. For today, what I have for you is um, how to prepare an aloe vera acne mask. Stay tuned and I'll be right back. Ingredients for today's tutorial include aloe vera gel, turmeric powder, and powdered milk. Aloe vera gel is a miracle plant that contains antioxidants, enzymes, vitamins A and C, and is highly anti-inflammatory. It can help treat bones, acne, and dry skin. The enzymes contained in aloe vera gel can help exfoliate the skin to make it smoother. But if you're looking for something stronger, you will need to go for something else. Aloe vera has um, a high moisturizing power and is very good for dry skin. I prefer the stabilized aloe vera gel compared to the plant itself because of the reaction on my skin. The second ingredient is turmeric powder. Turmeric, turmeric powder has anti-inflammatory properties with antibacterial benefits. It acts as an antiseptic on the skin by preventing the acne causing bacteria. It also has lightening agents that helps in the treatment of dark circles as well. Powdered milk is a very good exfoliant because of the presence of lactic acid in it. Though the exfoliating property is very mild, but its ability to absorb oil is what makes it very beneficial in this facial mask we are about to prepare. As oil is the major cause of your pores being blocked or clogged, leading to acne. Now we go into the preparation of this facial mask properly. We'll be needing a tablespoon of aloe vera gel a bit hard coming out but it's already out now then two tablespoons of powdered milk A pinch of turmeric powder is just fine because of its staining ability you wouldn't want your face all all turned orange or yellow 
depending on the shade of the turmeric so a pinch is just fine so we have to mix properly until we get a smooth mixture until we get a smooth mixture they're almost there there you have it all properly mixed up now this facial mask works best on clean skin so I'll go wash up my face with you could use a cleanser or a soap as it's normally called to wash off dirt grime and oil off your face before applying to freshly washed face and now apply the aloe vera acne mask kind of hard that is why I'm not using a brush because I won't be able to pick anything because I'm taking it with my my hands as you can see as I'm applying I'm also working it in like massaging it in I would advise you make this um, mask in, in small quantities because of the milk, of its milk content. It could go bad. So don't, um, don't make and keep for, for use later on. You can also apply it on your neck areas, depending on if you have acne on your neck as well. We apply in the neck region. And after application, <clears throat> you keep it to to sit for like ten minutes before washing off. So I'm going to go and take it off because it's um, a video. I'm going to go and take it off now. I'm sure you guys got so much value from today's tutorial. And be sure that from where today's lesson came from, there's so much more. So all you need to do is just sit back and subscribe to my youtube channel and don't forget to click on the notification bell so you'll be the first to know as soon as a new video comes up and don't forget to follow me on my social media handles as well i'll be glad to receive your feedback after you have tried this tutorial just drop your comments and i'll get to you as soon as possible so until we meet in my next video, stay beautiful. Cheers.